much time do you think you would need to find the cube root of such numbers or maybe such huge numbers? Well, what if I tell you a trick in which you can get it in 5 seconds? Yes, you heard it right. And you know this is possible when you are on this channel. So the answer to first one should be Seven point two. Yes, it is this quick. Well, you want to see one more question? Then check out the second one. It will be roughly eighteen point two. Yes, even you will be able to do all this magic within five seconds. So, want to know the secret behind this? Then. Let the magic begin. Now before I begin with this magical trick, you need to know three things about it. First, it's a beautiful trick in the sense you can apply it on any number. Yes, you heard it right, any number. So, no conditions applied. Secondly, you are not going to find this trick anywhere on the internet because I have worked with my team to actually did to actually go through the patterns and generalize this form in which you can get the answer super quickly but third make sure that this one gives us an approximate answer which is very very close to the exact one but you can expect an error of maximum 0.4 or 0.5 yani ke you have to apply this trick on the questions where you need an approximate value and with this let's roll so let's begin our magic with a three digit number first right for all the numbers all you need to remember is 1 cube to 10 cube which is simple right so now you know 372 is going to lie between 7 cube which is 343 and 8 cube which is 512 yani ki your answer is going to be 7 point something correct now how to find this something so what you can do is your denominator could be this minus this correct so this minus this as you can see is roughly giving us yeah it's giving us 169 now you don't have to take 169 you have to take its 90% 90% q i told you that we have gone very deep into seeing the patterns to aap 90% approximate le sakte hain now no 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 don't get into exact solving roughly aap 150 le lo okay for the numerator now all you need to do is this minus this that means 372 minus 343 which you can clearly see is giving us 29 so i can take it approximately as 30 by 150 which will be roughly 0.2 so that means i can get my answer to be 7.2 calculator se check karke dekh lo it is going to be very very close to it is going to be very very close to this number please make a note and then i'll take you aage calculator se check karke dekh lo it is going to be very very close to it is going to be very very close to this number please make a note and then i'll take you aage Initially you might feel that it is taking you around 10 15 seconds but trust me with a lot of practice you will actually be able to solve it in 5 seconds now let's watch out for a four digit number okay ab yahan pe aapne kya karna hai you can write it as let's say 5.961 into 10 cube why did i do this so that i know the cube root for this is directly 10 now focus on only this number where does the cube of this lie of course we know that your 1 cube is 1 and your 2 cube is going to be 8 so my number is going to be roughly 1 point something into 10 correct so now what you are going to do is again the same love triangle that means you will do this 8 minus 1 
which gives you 7. But you are going to take 90% of this. Yeah, 9 7 is a 63. So I know I can roughly take it to be 6.3. Now it will be 5.961 minus 1 which gives us 4.961. So yani approximately I can take it to be 5 by 6. Hmm, ab ye kya hota hai? Uh, I can say this is going to be 6 8s of 48 and 2 so roughly 0.82 yani 1.82 into 10 and bingo you can get your answer as 18.2 tha na bahut hi mazedar please make a note chaliye let's challenge ourselves further and dekhte hain how this technique works for a five digit number again the same kahani put a decimal after three places so this will become 82.615 into 10 cube matlab hame pata hai that in the end we have to do into 10 right now just focus on this now just try to recall 82 will lie between which two cubes it is simple 4 cube which is 64 and 5 cube which is 125 correct so your answer is going to be 4 point something into 10 let's find that something so in the base you are going to do 125 minus 64 which is going to give us 61 and iska lena hai apne 90 percent so roughly 54 correct now look at the denominator it will be 82.615 minus 64 so if i can take this to be uh, roughly 18 point something yani ki for easier calculations i can write it to be let's say 20 upon 55 correct jo kya ho jayega aapka 4 by 11 which is going to be approximately uh, 0.3 and then you will be left with so roughly 0.36 yani ke i can say 4.36 so 43.6 is approximately the answer ma'am seriously we will be applying the same trick on a six digit number also well you will find that yourself so Again, the same technique, you can write it as 267.315 into 10 cube. Yani ki aapko pata hai, into 10 hone wala hai. Now, just watch this one carefully. Bai hat ka khel hai to find out that it lies between 6 cube, which is 216, and 7 cube, which is 343. Yani mujhe pata chal gaya, my answer is going to be 6 point something into 10. Now let's figure out what's that 6 point something. So here again 343 minus 216 which is going to roughly give us 127. Now this 90% approximately to be 120. Now 267 minus 217 which is of course going to give us 51. So that means roughly I can take this to be 50 upon 120. Correct. So this is going to be 0.4 and so roughly 0.42. Yani ke I am going to get this to be 64.2. Bingo. The answer is done. Now let's check this technique one more time on a six digit number. So the same thing, you would put a decimal here so that it becomes this into 10 cube. Yani you are going to get something into 10. Now if you check this one out, it lies between 9 cube which is going to give us 729 and 10 cube which is 1000. Correct? Now 1000 minus 729 is going to be roughly 270. Up 270 ka you have to find the 90%. So not to be exact but somewhere around 240 this will be right. And 926.231 minus this would give us roughly your um, 197. Right. So for better calculations I can change it to 200 upon 240. So that means roughly I will get 5 by 
six, which is going to give me point eight one something. So that means my final answer is going to be ninety eight point one something. Trust me, guys, with a lot of practice, you can definitely solve these questions within five seconds. Okay, I have done my bit. Now it's your turn. So. Put on your thinking caps and find out the cube root of 526 using this technique. Trust me, you would love it. And make sure to comment the correct answer in the comment section below, as the top three correct answers would get named in my upcoming videos. So, maza aya. If your answer is yes, yes, yes. then make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel it's absolutely free and guys don't forget to check out my amazing trick which was on square root of any number using the shortcut way it's a personal recommendation make sure to do that and of course for and of course to check out more concept based videos or short tricks you can refer to the playlist section of this channel so make sure to hit that like button share it with all the people around you subscribe to the channel it's absolutely free i am going to see you super duper duper super soon till then thank you so much for watching bye bye